Hey YT, it's me, Jessie Ray. I just left the market. It's a little bit late and I didn't have dinner yet. And I thought I would share a little quick dinner salad recipe. You could do it for lunch. That um, anyone that's doing the Beautiful Brown Baby Doll Challenge or just any like just trying to eat healthier challenge can do. So I'm going to show you. So basically what I have here is, this is for both me and my husband. Um, this was a head of romaine lattice that I um, chopped up. This is some baby spinach. I'm just going to take like a big handful of it and um, put it in with there. Uh, a little bit, I think it would be better actually with red onion, but I didn't get any red onion. I saw I had a little bit of white onion, so I'm going to just put a little handful of that in there. This is about a third of a cucumber I chopped up with half an apple chopped up in there, put in there, blah, 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 blah. Um, this is goat cheese. I love goat cheese. A lot of recipes that I've seen for like a fruity, fruity nut type salad ask for feta cheese, but feta cheese be costing too much and goat cheese is usually cheaper. And on top of the fact that it's usually cheaper, it's usually fewer calories than feta actually. I put that in there. So, what else to put in here? Oh! Some dried cranberries. Uh, this is like the end of my dried cranberries. I'm just going to go ahead and stick them in there. And get those used up. Yay! Um, what else? <gasps> sunflower seeds! Because I love sunflower seeds. Take a handful of that or so. And for the protein in this salad, I... I'm going to try out this sweet and spicy stuff from Starkist. Um, I normally just pick whatever meat is in there. Like if I have some lunch meat, I'll cut it up and put it on top. If I have some like leftover shrimp or whatever, I'll chop those into like half and I'll put that on top. So what I'm going to do is just mix this salad up and I just realized that I did not prepare myself all the way. I'm boiling that water for my, um, I'm going to try something new tomorrow tomorrow. I'm getting it started tonight. I normally use like ham hocks or salt pork to make greens, but I want to try to make greens healthier, so I'm going to try it with some smoked turkey uh, necks. Oh, not neck. Is it is a big ass drumstick. What, are, what is this actually? Is it a drumstick? Is that what it is? Yeah, I'm going to try it with one of these and see how that goes, but that might be a, a recipe I'll do tomorrow. I'm just going to boil it down and get the meat off of it and see how it goes tomorrow. But, um, okay, so you mix that up, and then you put your, um, oopsie, you put your um, tuna in there, and what else was I going to tell you guys? Whatever dressing you like, whatever vinaigrette you like, I do not really care for sauce. I am like an anti-sauce kind of person. I usually just take a few lemon slices and just like s squeeze it on top, or sometimes I'll take like lemon juice, and I might put like a little bit of orange juice mixed in with lemon juice and that'll just be my dressing. I just I, I just can't get down with dressing. But why am I trying to do this one handed? Wow. Basically, so that's my salad. You can do it yourself. I need both hands to get the rest of this uh let me pour off some of that on there. Uh okay. To get that in there. Come out, come out. Come out. Why won't you come out? Oh, this is like the most grotiest recipe video ever of all time. But there you go. So toss it however you like, using both hands so it doesn't look all horrible the way mine does. And feed it to the husband, feed it to the kids. That's what I'm going to do. Well, that is my sweet and sour fruity nut salad. Hope you enjoyed the recipe, even though it was like kind of messed up looking. All right. Thank you. That's Theo. Theo, say hi. That's Theodore. Theo, did you say hi to everyone? Okay. All right. Well, thank you so much, guys. And as you know, if anyone has a cat, you have to save a little, a little piece of tuna for the cat or he goes crazy. He's just like, it's not fair. And I need to mop the floor. My goodness. This damn boy's making all that mess and stuff. All right. Well, 